Hello again, gamers, and welcome to Hump Day and Week 5 of our 100 Reviews in 100 Days. We've got a classic arcade game sitting here in the number 78 spot for you. Ladies and gentlemen, meet Miss Pac-Man. Now, by today's standards, Miss Pac-Man is god-awfully boring. But, in 1982, before the days of the side-scrolling awesomeness that Mario brought along, Miss Pac-Man was the game to play. Following the world-changing hit that Pac-Man was, Miss Pac-Man didn't have to change a whole lot to be successful. There were some big changes, but to the untrained eye, they're hardly noticeable. One of the most notable things that was changed from Pac-Man to Miss Pac-Man was a seemingly minute change that Miss Pac-Man's ghost didn't have distinct movement patterns. Those little bastards were unpredictable. That, coupled with the fact that there were a few map variances, and the high-scoring fruit was random and it bounced around. Again, these don't seem like huge differences, but considering the fact that you weren't a true arcade legend without a top 10 score in Miss Pac-Man at your local arcade should be proof enough that this game actually does deserve a spot on this list. We'll be leaving Miss Pac-Man with a 3.5 out of 5 today. Have an awesome day, gamers, and we'll see you tomorrow for the amazing game in spot number 77.